how they all work? It all comes down to a little device called a transistor. A transistor is basically like a little tiny electrical switch. But instead of being controlled by a lever or button, it's controlled by electrical loops. In this phone, there are nearly a hundred million transistors. In this computer, there's over a billion. The transistor is in virtually every electronic device we use. TVs, radios, Tamagotchis. But how does it work? Well, the basic principle is actually incredibly simple. It works just like this switch. So it controls the flow of electric current. It can be off, so you could call that the zero state, or it could be on, the one state. And this is how all of our information is now stored and processed in zeros and ones, little bits of electric current. But unlike this switch, a transistor doesn't have any moving parts, and it also doesn't require a human controller. Furthermore, it can be switched on and off much more quickly than I can flick this switch. And finally, and most importantly, it is incredibly tiny.